Hi uh, guys, I was going to show you a working uh, power brick out of a Tempest XY machine. I'm going to show you the voltages and how to check that out. Okay, give me a second. I got to set this up on a uh, tripod. Okay, what I've got here is I've got the brick turned on by the schematic here. Uh, pins four and five are both grounds. The way that this plug is set up, pin one is at the extreme bottom right, and then it goes one, two, three, four, five, six. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 has no pin, 13 has a pin, 14 and 15 have no pins in there. Okay, so 4 and 5 are connected and those are your ground for your DC voltage here. So it's going to be right around, it says here on the schematic, around 11 volts. It could be as high as 15 volts here. So I'm touching pin 3 here so we got 14.8 14.8 14 14.8 volts okie dokie so that's your uh, DC voltage down here in your connector okie dokie so let's uh, switch the voltage up now to the AC side here Okie dokie. And between pins six and seven, you have 36 volts. So, and that would be on the AC side. So, one, two, three, four, five, six. There's seven there. Seven, and let's see, we got six here. So, that one would be right there. And here goes the voltage, and it's going. 36, 37 and a half volts. So that's right where it's supposed to be. Okie dokie. Okay, and then for between 8 and 9, we have roughly 6 volts. So let's see, there is pin 7. That one is a male connector there. So I'll put that one in there. Here we go. It's reading between seven and eight. And we got 6.2 volts. There you go. Got that. Okie dokie. We got one more to test here. And that'd be between pin 10 and 13. So here we go. Pin 10 is this one here. Actually, let's put it on the top here, if we can do it. Kind of rough. Okay. There's one. Okay. And we got 50 volts there. Now if we go in the middle one here, you're going to get around 25 because that splits it in half. Got that? So 50 volts AC between pins 10 and 13. 50 volts. There you go. If you got that kind of voltages on your XY deflection brick, it should be a good to go uh, brick. Okie dokie. You have a great day. I uh, figured since I'm already here and showing you stuff, uh, let's look at this audio regulator board real fast. What usually goes on this particular board is the resistor right here that's just right of this uh, potentiometer. When it's under load, you should be getting right around 5 volts. Okay? And uh, I'll just showing you that real quick, but 5 volts under load. So you can see how the board there is kind of burnt, but uh, you should be getting right around 5 volts there from that potentiometer 
when I get a hold of one of these games, I usually uh, pull the board right out there and then I put a, a flame proof uh, resistor in there. So that's one other thing you might want to consider doing on your Tempest or Star Wars on your auto audio regulator board. Have a good one. Peace out.